Jessie Draper, the Valley Girl. Valley Girl. Let's talk business. I'm like the Valley Girl. Melon is a headband and mobile app that measures your focus during different activities. It assesses the effects of different stimuli and uses the data to help you improve your focus and learn more effectively. Laura Berman is co-founder of Melon. Here we are with Laura of Melon. So how are you doing? I'm good, how are you? Good, I am so good and I'm so excited to hear about Melon. So we're at Launchpad LA mm -hmm. and um, you guys are working, you're, you're working here, you're in the accelerator class yep. right now. Mm -hmm. um, so what is Melon? So Melon is an EEG headband and what and it does, have some here. we have some here. So if you want to put it on, I'll explain what it does. Yes. So you have it, did it's I write backwards. It the, oh, it's the backwards. See, I don't even know the style it's weighted. <laughs> Is this right? Yeah. Or did I do it this? Oh, there you go. Way. Yeah, that's perfect. Okay. okay. I feel just like cooler wearing it. Yeah, it looks great, by the way. <laughs> it <laughs> looks great on it. Yours matches, actually. Oh, well, matches I, your did, I did that intentionally. <laughs> <laughs> um, so yeah, what it's doing is it's measuring your brain activity and we correlate that to focus. And then we have an app and you can put in like what you're working on and where you are. And we see how those tags affect your focus and then you can learn how to improve from that and understand yourself better. So like right now it's measuring my brain activity. Yeah, exactly. Right now. Mm -hmm. It's like hanging out with my brain. Yes. Brain activity. Yeah, and it's just, it's totally normal, right? Like yeah. you can't tell, it's no. just, you're just wearing the headband. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's amazing. And so how do you, so you correlate that with focus and what does that mean? So what that means, focus for us is just like um, focus on one task at a time. Okay. So you know like when your mind is kind of wandering and you're bouncing around, that's not focus. But when you're like really zoned in on one thing, that's what focus is and this is tracking how well you're doing that at any given time. Okay, oh my gosh, that's amazing. And what is an EEG? Is that what you mean? Yeah, EEG. Okay, what is that? So what that is, is your brain is constantly giving off electrical activity. So like at any given moment, all these um, different types of electrical activity is coming off of your brain and different types and amounts of that correlate to different mental states. So kind of like EKG measures the electrical activity from your heart, okay. EEG measures electrical activity from your brain. Wow, that's incredible. So how did you, why did you decide to start this? So we decided to start this when Ari and I, my co-founder, were both um, studying cognitive science and computer science in college and we were both doing research, and he was doing a lot of work with brain imaging, and specifically EEG, and saw how powerful the technology is, but also that it wasn't leaving the lab in like, a helpful and effective way in daily life. So we decided to kind of take the technology that helps kids, um, it cures kids' ADHD, and it helps you know, older people with um, kind of brain decay and things like that and we decided to make a product that really fits in people's day-to-day -day life so they could understand themselves better through this information. So this could help diagnose something like like ADHD? It, it could help treat it, yeah. Help so, treat it, oh mm -hmm. my goodness. And so how, how does that work? How does it help treat it? So basically there are some principles of biofeedback, specifically neurofeedback, where you can see your brain activity in real time and then there are treatments based on that to help you like identify good brain patterns and replicate those. So that's what they do with kids in the lab. Oh my gosh. It's really amazing. That is amazing. Okay, so how does this differ? I know there's a lot of, you know, like there's the Nike Fuel Band mm -hmm. and there's a whole bunch of um, things for fitness, but this isn't for, fit, for fitness, right? No, so when we built the headband specifically so that people could wear it during athletics if they wanted to because focus is such a huge important part of athletics. Right, right. But, um, it's similar in the sense that we're both in the quantified self space. So like there's this big movement right now to understand exactly kind of what your body is doing and put a number on that. Okay. But where we're different is that we don't really focus on the numbers because if you just saw your raw brainwave activity, like if you're looking at a screen of it right now, you'd have no idea what was going on. So our platform is really based on giving you insights into that so that you can really understand what the data that we're measuring means for you. And then you can learn to improve from that. So we give you insights like, at the end of this interview, if you were this during every interview, we could tell you like you were most focused, you know, during this interview. So you and could tell me like when I zone out or something, when I mm -hmm, kind of space mm -hmm. out in the middle of an interview. Yeah. So say you wanted to find out if I you should wear be these all the time. <laughs> if you should be interviewing in the morning or in the evening based on your focus. And this would help you figure it out and we give you those specific insights exactly. That's so great. Oh my goodness. So these are amazing. So you guys, so what is your kind of five year plan? So our five-year plan 
is still, it's in development. But okay. right now we're on Kickstarter, so we're selling this product with the app that I was describing. And then we're delivering that at the end of this year. And then starting next year, we're looking to put these in stores. And from there, we have some other products in the pipeline that we're working on and some other mobile applications to help us expand this in different verticals. Where can people get one? So once the Kickstarter is over, if they go to our website, usemelon.com, we'll, be ha we'll have a link where they can sign up to be on the waiting list. Okay, so go to usemelon.com. <laughs> <laughs> so, okay, you are clearly a great entrepreneur. You and your um, co-founder have started this company together. What mm -hmm. is one piece of advice that you would leave an up-and-coming entrepreneur with? Um, I would say if you become an entrepreneur, you've identified some sort of problem or something that is really important to you that you want to fix. And when you become an entrepreneur, you meet all of these people who are giving you tons of advice, and it's great to listen to all of it. But you also should keep track or like, keep your keep track of what made you become an entrepreneur in the first place and not lose sight of it so that you're actually still solving the problem you set out to solve from the beginning. It's easy to get pulled in all kinds of directions and just stay focused on Stay kind of what your passion on the, is on the end point. Mm -hmm. What's the end point for melon? For melon, I think it's just really about everyone will be wearing one. <laughs> that would be great. That would be great. But yeah, it's really just about helping people understand themselves in ways that they haven't been able to before. I'm like the Valley Girl, and I'm like Laura from Melon. And now it's time for your dits moment. Melon. What kind of melon do you like? Watermelon. Watermelon? Mm -hmm. I like cantaloupe. Cantaloupe's good too. But one time I ate a whole one and I, I broke out in hives. So now you don't like it so anymore? So now I just don't eat as much. <laughs> I wouldn't eat it if that happened to me. <laughs> <laughs>